I'm Edie Lush, and I'm here in the Hub Culture Pavilion in Davos, and I'm very pleased to be joined by Rich Strombach, principal at Fortune Group. Tell me a little bit about the party scene. I heard a hilarious story about the sort of parties within the party. So it was when Tony Blair and Jimmy Wales left the Wednesday night party that you really knew where the power was going, where the real fun of the party was going. And it's the social interaction that makes Davos so interesting. Yeah, the interesting thing, you know, here in Davos uh, about the social scene, which is, you know, very important to the uh, business tech and finance communities mm -hmm. in terms of achieving their agendas um, and doing deals and building relationships to further business, um, are that there's these different tiers mm -hmm. of uh, kind of social parties. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, you were saying the story about right. they left the Google party, they were going to a Sh Jimmy Chalet party on right. Wednesday night, which was a great party. Mm -hmm. um, those are the kind of, you know, very private, mm -hmm. you, know, you know, not well known, people hear about them after the fact parties. And, you know, those are the kind of the coveted parties to get into. Because right. they're very, very exclusive, you know, VIP, you, you have moments where you can spend, you know, half an hour or an hour mm -hmm. having a discussion with someone who through the rest of the year may, you may not have time to have that interaction. Right. Or you may not be in the same place, right? Yes. How much is kind of this organized serendipity, do you think, a part of Davos? Um, well, there's a, lot of, there's a lot of that in terms of, um, you know, putting yourself in a place where you can have that, uh, you know, the best, the best chance mm -hmm. of having a, mm -hmm. you know, something you know great happen. Um, so it's a huge part of it, but there's also a lot of kind of, you know, pre-planned, right. pre-organized because, you know, it's extremely difficult to host anything in this town. Right. It takes and expensive, right? Expensive and difficult logistically. Right. Um, so how, what's the sort of tier ranking of the parties? You've got the special chalet parties at the top and what yeah. comes underneath that? Well, there's really, a, you know, the chalet parties um, comes down to the kind of the guest list. Mm -hmm. And there's people within the community that, you know, that have, you know, they're known for having great parties and, you know, VIP guest lists. Mm -hmm. and, and if you get in there, it's, you know, it's going to be the social scene that night. Right. So, those, there's a lot of those that happen in chalets. Mm -hmm. It's not just at chalets, like, you know, Sean Parker had the right. party at the Cabana Room, which mm -hmm. was Unbelievable. a great was really party, fun. yeah. Yeah, so. I was dancing with John Legend at that point. Oh, yeah. It was fun. Yeah. But it's, they're surreal. <laughs> right. You know, so that was a bigger one. That was a party that you, it would be too big for a chalet, but, right. but it was, uh, you know, an amazing party. I think it was the, it was the best party I've been to in right. Dallas. <laughs> right. So. Good. Well, at least I went to that one. Yeah. Good. And what about tonight? What are you looking forward to tonight? Yeah, there's, uh, you know, the main parties on the on the agenda that are public, uh, the Yahoo party mm -hmm. is going to be amazing. And Marissa mm -hmm. always has an amazing function. Uh, the Mongolia night mm -hmm. one is going to be a fun, Absolutely. is going to be a fun one. Yeah. And the Salesforce party, mm -hmm. which is in the place where uh, Sean held his party last okay. year. Those are the kind of the official on the agenda parties. And then there's going to be a very cool one that's, you know, that's not well known, a cool chalet party. Okay, so I've got an invite to one out of four, so I'm not doing too badly. Right? Yeah, which one are you going to? I'm going to go to the Mongolian with the great oh. DJ Jacques Lavoisier. Yeah, that's my buddy Olivier. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Rich, thank you very so. much for stopping into the Hub Culture Pavilion. Great, thank you. Davos, and I'm Edie Lush. Thank you.